Such a strange looking flock. Welcome, I'm Hawaiian Shirt Papa. Sometimes with others, I visit a variety of antique, vintage, and thrift shops within Southern Ontario. Sometimes we don't get anything. Come tour with me vicariously. Hello, and welcome to another tour by Hawaiian Shirt Papa. This one's of the Mission Thrift Store in St. Catharines. It's an um, interesting location. It's a, quite a large store. Uh, you enter at one door currently and exit from the other one. At least they did that during COVID. Uh, here you see some of the items that are in the front counter. They have more than one of these batches of counters. One's by the cash and the other one's across an aisle and still at the front window area. There are items inside that you can see. There are items that are outside at this storefront that you can bid upon as well. They have quite a bit of furniture. They have greeting cards. Uh, it's not something you find at very many thrift stores. There are some but not too many. We're walking towards the front of the store to the section where they have the items being bid. Like I said, quite a bit of furniture. They have some objects for the auction set up in these glass cases. You need to get a bidder number and uh, then you can bid to your heart's content. The bidding is done in a binder. The number is used so that no personal identifying information is revealed to the other bidders. It's not a bad system in that sense. They had a lot of really interesting items up for bid. They have a hard dead date by which they do close their bidding. Some places they have a softer close where it's so many days of no bidding. You saw some games, so you see some magazines, books. Some of the magazines are also the uh, knitting and sewing pattern books. And they tend to have walkers. Oh yes, LPs and the clothing. We are looking for Hawaiian shirts. These tend to be long sleeves. There's a couple of contenders, I think. No point being shy if you're going to wear that one. There's a contender. Silver and black or black and white. The other ones I may have seen, they're made of in quite a small size. Quite nice looking furniture that they have here. Some artwork and the women's clothes. Bags, purses, and sh footwear. Some more footwear here. 
glass and crystal. They do have both. They do have some change rooms. I don't remember if they were available yet. These are uh, ceramics and a little statuary besides serving pieces. And here's some other glassware, vases, for example. They may have had some silver plate as well. Some serving pieces and dining plates. And we continue on with other bits and pieces of decor of small appliances. A good representation of them. There were some electronics. Sheets, towels, and cloth are also available here. It's quite a bit of uh, magazines and such. So nice looking uh, bits and pieces. Sometimes they were stacked in this case. One of the better chairs. Oh, that one's for auction, yes. So were some of these other ones here. These were actually in the sh uh, street windows, the showcase windows that face outwards. So that isn't the price, that is the item number for bidding. Don't take these as still being available when you see this video. This is just a representation of the type of items they do put up for auction. Some of it's vintage. Some of it's newer than older. So you get to pick which ones you wish to bid on, of course. Quite a collection of items that they've placed in the sh sh street showcase windows. Plus the items they have inside the store on top of all of this. And there's a secretary desk. The roll top. All kinds of items that they put up for auction. They understand there's a bit more value in them. Doesn't mean they always get the price that they were really hoping for, but hey, that's the nature of an auction, isn't it? This is a view inside from the door area. That's the entrance area. This is the exit area. This side has the auction items to the left and furniture straight in front. So their hours are a bit shorter than others. So you have to keep that in mind. Thursdays, they're open a bit later. Well, thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed this. We'd appreciate a subscribe and a, a thumbs up, a like. And maybe you'd like to put in a mark on the bell so you get notifications. Thanks a lot, folks. Bye-bye.